Hello! Uh, how the fudge you doing? Hey guys, D-Field here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Now today, we are going to start off on the Bad Lion server, because if you guys did not hear on Twitter yesterday, I got banned off of Bad Lion during a live stream. Now guys, it's not a permanent ban, but if you guys can look at your screen right now uh, on the chat, it says that I was banned for illegal mining. Now, that is the dumbest reason to get banned for because like what like what but anyways let's talk about it a little bit I'm gonna talk about it a little bit with you guys today in this video and I decided to do a little bit of a voiceover instead of an actual commentary because like obviously I want to focus on the story that is at hand but anyways um, so I got banned off a of bad line yesterday I had about a thousand viewers on live stream we were just chilling um, talking to my live stream viewers as I always am and then we got randomly banned off of the server now obviously there are a lot of toxic players on bad line I'm not gonna lie you guys already know the community there's a lot of toxic players on bad line and I guess they decided to target me and uh, report me like 50 times like I got like 20 reports for like specific games that I was quote-unquote illegally mining now herein lies the problem let me let me talk to you about this real quick all right so I got banned because under the assumption that, or under my, what I assumed, I thought that literally um, the rules were, like almost every other UHC server, is that you could start a staircase anywhere. So like if your cave was at 11, if your cave is at 16, you could just start staircasing down and work your way to bedrock, and then you have to mine all the way up to Y32, right? That was my assumption. And the weirdest part is that was the same assumption that the owner of the server, yes, I talked to the owner of the server and I'm like, yeah, those are those are your rules, right? Like I'm pretty sure it's you can staircase anywhere and then as long as you go back up to 32, you're fine. So that was the assumption that I was under and the owner of the actual server. So like literally the owner of the bad line. So I talked to him last night about it and I was like, yeah, so what did I get banned for? So apparently the rules of the actual server are that where it doesn't matter where you are, even if you're on Y11, you can't staircase down and then go back up to 32 like it, that like that's the rules like you just can't it's not allowed like you you have to go back up first before you staircase down like it makes no sense it's like the dumbest rule i've ever heard and like i mean i'm pretty sure if you guys have played or seen any other uhc's anywhere it's always that you can staircase down but then you have to go all the way back up now bear in mind guys that i am live streaming and i'm not paying attention a hundred percent all the time to my actual, uh, what is it, what do you call it? To my actual, um, I'm not paying attention to my actual in-game Y value 100% of the time, you know? So basically, there'd be times where sometimes I'd be digging down at like 28 after staircasing up. There'd be times where I'm digging at like 31 or like 25. Like, you know, super, super random because I'm not paying attention to that. Like, I've got, I've got bigger things to worry about. I'm in the middle of a freaking live stream, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's the problem. So, I mean, I understand if they had to bad me for that reason, which is completely fine. Like, I take responsibility for that. But here's the other, like, issue, I guess, with the server. So, obviously, I'm a live streamer and I'm live streaming the server. Server. But the problem is they decided to ban me in the middle of a live stream, which is like, okay, that's fine. But the rules of the server are you are allowed to ban evade. Okay, so me as a live streamer, as a UHC live streamer, got banned got banned for quote unquote illegally mining, but then I could ban evade and just get on another account and do the same thing. But I was an hour into the UHC and then I got banned, so then literally it was like a waste of an hour of my life. So I don't understand why out of um, out of all the different or out of all the other people that they could be watching, you know, on on the server, they decide to target a live streamer, especially someone who's trying to just entertain people on their server and advertise for their server on Twitch. Like, I just don't get it. Like, why ban me when I could literally just hop on an account and then play again? You know, like I under like I feel like they need to kind of change up their rules a little bit when it comes to um when it comes to ban evasion because what's the point of what's the point of having the rules and actually banning people if they're a live streamer number one and number two if they can literally just ban evade a second after you know what i'm saying so like it's i'm i'm in that rare scenario i guess where i am a live streamer and that applies to me but i guess um I understand that p other people do ban evade on the server anyways, and they, uh, you know, they, they focus on other things. They do, um, what is it called? They actually try to legitimately hack, and that's why they're ban evading. But, like, 
I'm live streaming, bro. You need to understand that I am trying to talk and interact with my chat. I'm trying to interact with all the people of my live streaming community. Like you can't expect me to 100% every time dig down, you know, dig up to 32 if I'm like just staircasing while talking, you know what I'm saying? So like, I'm not trying to like say that you treat a live streamer specially, but like you can't blame me or like, I, I just don't see the point of banning a live streamer who can be just ban evade again. Like it just makes no sense in an advertising or even in a game standpoint. Like what would be the point of banning me when I can get on another account? You guys see what I'm trying to say? Like that's why it made no sense. Now, I feel like the bad line needs to just have a talk within themselves and figure out what they actually want to do with these rules because obviously um, they have like some sort of internal quarrel right now about what the rules actually are. So that I hope, I mean, hopefully they get that all figured out because I, I honestly like, I love playing on their server. I love advertising for them. I love doing all that stuff for them. But like, if I get banned for illegally mining and I have to play on an alt account that literally will just have the same exact ranks and everything else that my other account has as a live streamer what's the point dude like what's the point man bad line get shit together dude get your shit together man like it just does not make any sense there's no possible like right i like it just doesn't make sense dude if you're gonna ban somebody for a reason you shouldn't have ban evasions like you shouldn't let ban evasions occur because i understand that you're trying to keep players on your server but if they're ban evading dude like What's the what's the difference? Like why why even do it in the first place, man? Like it doesn't. Uh, you guys see? I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say here. But anyways, guys, that is gonna be it for today's video. I just had a uh, had a rant a little bit about that. I found it really amusing that I got banned on Badline, but then it wasn't a permanent ban. But then also, I can ban evade while I'm banned on another account that literally has the same exact things as my original account but hopefully they fix it hopefully they get it together and we'll see exactly what happens but anyways guys that is going to be it for today's video i am still feeling a little sick hopefully uh getting better soon but thank you guys so much for watching this is d field have a fantastic day everybody we'll see you guys later